Welcome everybody, we're back with another Whiskey Quickie, and today we're looking at Chicken Cock Chanticleer. I guess you're wondering, what? Yeah. how did you come up with that name, Kenny? <laughs> I didn't. Chicken Cock did. But well, let's give you some of the details. Yeah, I just wonder if you pronounced it right. Uh, it's probably Chanticleer, maybe is what it is. Yeah, who knows. Yeah, well, and the only reason why I probably butchered it is because this is Kentucky Straight Bourbon finished in French cognac barrels, which Ooh, we all love. We love cognac finished. Um, just love it in general. I love a lot of good cognacs nowadays, too. But this special release celebrates the longtime French-American friendship dating back to the 1700s during the American Revolutionary War. And Bourbon County, Kentucky was named after the royal French family, the Bourbons, and Paris, Kentucky, where Chicken Cock was founded in 1856. And that was named after, of course, Paris, France. This limited edition release is bottled in a Prohibition-era style replica apothecary style bottle, which is, as you can see right here, a lot of stuff going on, but also comes in a nice little tin case in case you hear that one as well. If you didn't, you yeah. just hear it again. There's the second one. It's bottled at 112 proof, and this features a mash bill of 70% corn, 21% rye, and 9% melted barley. Only 32 barrels of Champ de Clear were produced, and comes in at an SRP of $500. Oh, dang. I mean, I really like this tin, but... Yeah. 500 bucks. Well, I don't yeah. know. Like, we'll see. You get a second use out of it. Like I said, you can put your band-aids in there. You I feel your... like you put your time capsule buried in the ground. And somebody That'd be cool to dig up and be like, oh, be like man, how old is that? And you'll realize uh, it's only from 2022. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> but it really did a cool job of kind of bringing oh, I the, love the, packaging. The, yeah. the old it's... world style to it. Yep. All right. On to the nose. I get like fig dates. Yeah, you get that like kind of cereal bar, like Fig Newtons, Nutri-Grain bar kind of thing. Like some, there's some like brandy cereal kind of bready notes, but there's also that like sweet, fruity, dark fruit component too. Which of course is probably from the cognac. Yep. All right, on to the taste. So it's nice and sweet. It's got some great viscosity for it, creamy. Um, there's that... I'm really getting that like brainy kind of cereal type flavor on the front and mid palate. Uh, I get like a, almost like a, uh, like if your, if your maple syrup was like garnished with a little bit of fruit in there. I mean, it's not this, it's not a huge explosion. Like you're not going to be palate fatigued. Like it's not blowing up your, your no, tongue, your taste balanced. buds. It's very easy, very easy to drink. Yeah. Now as it sits here more, I'm getting... On the front, more a little more chocolate cacao like powder, um, yeah, like a it's almost like a like a waffle and syrup with fruit on it and whipped cream is kind of what I'm getting. I'm right there with you. Yeah, on the nose, how you gonna rate it? Thumbs up. I like the nose. I think so too. On the taste, thumbs up. I can I, I, I don't kind of. I do like it. I do like <laughs> it. I do like yeah. it. Yeah. And the finish. Uh, sideways. I'll go sideways. Sideways. I, I wanted that like fruity. There was this really nice fruity component. It just kind of dissipates at the end. But uh, overall, it's very well balanced. Uh, easy sipper. Like I, I, I can't remember what you said the proof was. Uh, da, 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 one twelve. One twelve. Yes. Yeah, it drinks lighter than that. So I think it drinks a ton lighter than yeah, one twelve. To think, be honest with you. Yeah, it's actually very dangerous at one twelve. <laughs> um, dangerously delicious. So nice job with this. Yeah, I, I agree. It's what one of those things is. I, I look at it coming from the finish thinking like, oh, you want more, and you're like, wait, is do you want more, or is it just nice and balanced and just easy to sip? Because you're right, at 112, it's surprising how easy that is to drink. Yep. But that is our review of Chicken Cox Chunt de Clear Whiskey. And I'm sure you'll let us know we mispronounced it. Yes, absolutely. Okay. But cheers, everybody. We'll see you next time. Toodles. Toodles.